Yes, queen. Yes, jailhouse queen. Hell no. To the no, no, no. Yeah, to the no. Good morning, my lovelies, my beauties, my friends. My name is Christina and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. I really hope that you will subscribe, stick around, take a chance on hearing some things that I have to say. And if you are a returning subscriber, see y'all already know, y'all are my babies. So today I am a little excited, a little nervous about this video. Listen, I don't know how this happened, you guys, but some video popped up in my suggested feed from this girl and it said jailhouse makeup. So I knew exactly what it was when I saw it and I clicked on it and I had forgotten all about that. How in the world, you know why it was. I only spent six months in the county jail and the rest of my time was at prison. And at prison, you can buy certain types of makeup. I mean, it ain't no Sephora or anything, girlfriend, but you can buy a couple little things. So I had forgot all about creating jailhouse makeup out of things like pencils and Vaseline and coffee. So I'm going to recreate it. We're gonna go from 2019, Christina, back to 2005, Christina, and I'm gonna do my makeup the way I did it whenever I was in jail. Now, I didn't wear makeup every single day in there or makeup, whatever you wanna call it, um, but what we would do is if we were like going to court or we you know, thought we were gonna see somebody, we would try to get cute with our little pencil eyeliner and our coffee on our eyelashes. And the crazy thing is, is there's no mirrors in jail, okay, or prison. I, I tried to find one when I went shopping. They have, they look, they literally look like pans that you would cook with, but they have a reflection on them, enough that you can see yourself, but you can't clearly see yourself. So the weird slash scary thing is, we would do our makeup in these reflection type-ish mirrors that we had, and then when we would go to court, I would see my actual reflection in like a window or something, and I would be mortified, because I'd be like, ah, that's what I look like. I mean, whenever I was looking in the mirrors that I couldn't hardly see myself, I looked cute. And then when I could actually see myself, I was like, ah. So we're gonna take a trip down memory lane. I'm gonna leave the girl's channel linked in the description box below. So if you wanna go and check her video out, she did give me this inspiration. And um, yeah, so I hope you like this video. Psst, please don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna ask you now. All right, let's get into it. Okay, so here we are, nice and tired looking with all of my bags, and I'm good and broke out, which is about how I would look if I was in the county jail right now. Now, I'm gonna show you guys the first thing that I would do. Now, in there, clearly, we didn't have anything like this. We used the sink or the walls. Now, I will tell you that if we got caught doing this, we could get rode up for contraband. We could get thrown in the hole, depending on how the guard feels. So, it was always like, you know, you just kind of, trying to get away with it or if there was a certain guard that came on and you knew you had on makeup you would try to stay out of their face because some of them were nasty and they would just throw you in the hole um because and write you up for contraband so this is what we would do now I would take the sink and take some powder okay <laughs> i know it's hard to see because of the light and then some instant coffee you guys now the instant coffee is dark and it's powdery, so if you mix it with the powder and you get the color that you want, you can make a powder for your face. Ooh, it's gonna be crazy. Okay, so I'm gonna try my best to mix it together. And knowing me, I would probably take something to try to crunch it. Which the commissary is if your family sends you money, then once a week you get a paper. This is how it works in jail. It's totally different in prison. But once a week you get a paper and you can mark on there what you want. And then the commissary, it's usually inmate workers that work in the commissary. They bring it to you. So like I said, you can order powder and instant coffee on there. Goodness. So I'm going to get lucky today and actually get to use a mirror to do this. But like I said, in the county jail, there, there are no mirrors. It's just a reflection pan. So 
Let's get this powder started. <laughs> Probably gonna stain my face. <laughs> I'm not telling y'all it's gonna look good. I'm just telling y'all this is what we did. And like I said, nine times out of 10 is we would do our makeup in those pans and then we'd go to court and we'd see our reflection in like a real reflection of a window or in the truck, the van that they put you in. And then we would, I would personally be mortified. But I also have bad skin. Like I have blemishes and dark spots and all that. And, and so Oh my gosh, I'm going to break out. <laughs> okay, then I would take a toothbrush and I would comb out my eyebrows. The toothbrushes in there are nowhere, and then I got this from the dollar store for a dollar, okay? The toothbrushes in there are nowhere near as nice as this, so they... The bristles on them are very soft. You know, like when you brush your teeth, you feel like you're basically brushing them with your fingers and it doesn't matter who you are in there. Your breath always stinks because the toothbrushes don't work. So brush out the brows. We're trying to get some fancy. Uh -uh. Okay, now I'm gonna make eyeshadow. And with eyeshadow, we would take deodorant and a magazine. Now you're going to go through the magazine and pick what color you want. What color are we going to do today, lady? Let's do blue, okay? So you're going to take the deodorant and rub it really good on the color that you want. You can see it's already coming off on the deodorant. Now I'm going to take my finger and just get some of that color. See the blue on my fingernail? See all the blue in the deodorant? I'm gonna take that off and put it on my eyes. And if you have nails on when you go in there, they make you take them off. And if you're like acrylic and you can't take them off, they make you cut them off. Certain types of hairstyles, like, you know, if girls had like braids in their hair and stuff, or if they had a wig on, well, if they had braids in their hair, they couldn't really get them out. But if you had a wig on, like glued in or whatever, they make you take it out. So sometimes girls in there, they're looking crazy because they just had to like remove their wig or their hair extensions without the proper stuff that they need to remove it with. And then their hair is damaged. Now for eyeliner, I still cannot believe that we did this because I don't know how lead poisoning works with being that close to your eye, but we would take a little Vaseline now. You cannot buy Vaseline on the commissary. You actually have to get it from the nurse's station and tell them that it's for your lips. And we clearly didn't have these plates, but we had cement walls. So we would put the Vaseline on the cement walls and then we would take a pencil because we weren't allowed pens. And you're going to make a dark colored paste with the pencil. See the dark colored paste that we can use for like a liquid eyeliner now? <laughs> you guys. Listen, I if you don't try this at home, but if you do, DM me a picture on the gram. Oh. I've never really been good at winged eyeliner anyway. So.
How are we looking? <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows. This is literally how I looked in jail, all washed out like this, like pale and sickly looking. This is literally how I looked in jail. Now I'm gonna do a little blush because we need to add a little bit of, you know, color to this face. So I'm gonna find a pink or red. And it needs to be somewhat dark because it's not going to show up very good anyways. Ooh, that looks like a pretty color blush. You guys, this, this pencil is burning my eyeball. And I remember it burning my eye whenever I was in jail too. There's our blush. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, she fancy. Oh yeah, that totally did it. <laughs> Let's do a little bit more. All right, guys, now that you have on your base, your blush, your eyeliner, your eyeshadow, and your eyebrows, now we're gonna do lashes. So for lashes, we're going to use coffee again and a little bit of water. And I'm gonna use the bottom of this. I'm gonna do it just like I would do in jail and make this paste for you. How I would do it in jail was I would take a toothbrush, put the paste on there, oh God bless guys, and do my lashes. And like I said before, I thought I was cute in those mirrors until I saw a re real reflection of myself and I was like, oh hell no. Why not just color in these brows a little bit more for funsies? Oh yes, yes queen. Yes, jailhouse queen. All right, and just like any good makeup, we are going to finish it off with a little lipstick. Okay, typically I would use Kool-Aid or something like that in order to make lipstick, but because your girl didn't have any money for commissary and I don't have any lipstick. I'm going to use a Dorito. Doritos will stain your fingers, but they will also stain your lips. Okay. So <laughs> we're going to <sighs> Oh God bless. Gross. That's disgusting. Y'all know they were throwing me in the hole, honey, if they caught me. <laughs> if I haven't told you this enough times here, the mirror is there. You can't hardly see yourself, right? So you think you're looking cute, okay? And if you don't leave for court, like if you're just in there, then you don't really get to see yourself. You're looking at a reflection. It's like looking through beer goggles all the time and you're like, oh, I'm cute. Oh, I am so cute, girl. Oh, I am so cute. Like, hey. <laughs> Hell no. To the no, no, no. Yeah, All right, y'all, that is it for your jailhouse tutorial for the day. I know this video was absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I know some of y'all have been to jail. Let me know if y'all saw girls doing this or if you did do this. Let me know if you think my eyes are going to fall out of my head from putting this in my eyes. Is my face going to break out? Ah! <laughs> All right, y'all, please don't forget to like this video. It is a free way that you can help me 
out. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.